So the reason you clicked on this video is to find out how I built all of this gym for £60. So let me give you a quick rundown of what we're going to be getting into in today's video. Um, first of all, I'm going to do a workout with the home gym and then I'm going to talk to you about how I managed to get this home gym for the £60. I'm going to be going through my workout and what I'm going to be doing in my workout is I'm going to be doing, obviously because I only have 90kg on the bar. That's the most weight I have that fits on the bar, 90kg. Overall, I've got 120kg, but that's 90kg. So I'm going to be doing pause squats for 12 reps for 4 sets, so 4 times 12 of 90 kg pause squats. And then after I manage to do that, I'm gonna move on to bench, 90 kg for three sets of eight. So um, finding ways to make it more difficult, for example, pause squats and increasing the reps, um, or beltless, having no belt on, that's the kind of way I can make it tough for myself. So when I come out of quarantine, I don't lose any of my gains. Because if I just did 90 kg for 12 reps, no pause, with a belt, with, with straps, that's easy for me, like, I could do 100 reps like that. So if I make it harder, put the pause squat in, and obviously today I'm going to be using the belt, but um, in the last set of bench, I'm going to be removing the belt. Um, that's how I can make it harder, and that's how I can keep my gains. So the reason you clicked on this video is to find out how I built all of this gym for £60. And I'm going to tell you now. So everyone's in quarantine and like others, I spent the first two weeks um, just sad. Couldn't go to the gym, couldn't really do anything, was just wasting my time. Basically thought to myself I was going to lose all my gains, um, all my weight, all my size. Um, I was planning a cut, so I thought that's not going to go ahead either. Um, so I was just... How many other people who go to the gym were feeling, I was feeling down. Now this is the first thing I suggest all of the people who are watching this video do, is if you go and you ask everyone, everyone you know, you say, have you got any spare gym equipment? Have you got any spare barbells, dumbbells, weights, anything? Because that's where I got a majority of the weights from. That's where I got the weights I was using today from. The bar and the, the 90 kg that go on the bar, I got that all from other people who I don't know. I don't really know them very well, but just because they weren't using them, they let me use it. So, number one thing I suggest for all of you to do is ask everyone around you, hey, do you have any weights? Do you have any gym equipment? Um, say, listen, I'm really in need of some gym equipment. Um, could you help me out? Do you have anything? Um, a majority of people are gonna say no, you know? But if you really want it, then you keep asking and, and eventually someone will say yeah, and you get your first barbell, because that's what happened to me. I got my first barbell, the one I didn't use today, and it got a few weights of it, about 25 kg worth of weights. I was like, wow, like I'm set, like I was like, I'm set. Then I kept asking around, found the bar of 90 kg of weights, and then kept asking around, found the bench. And these people I didn't even know, I wasn't close to them, I wasn't friends with them, you know, um, only, I only knew them through family. Because they weren't using it, what reason do they have not to let me use it? Most people are gonna say no, but the few who do say yes, obviously they're gonna be able to gift you with some equipment, 
um, and get you out of that slump where you haven't been working out. Or maybe some of you have a bit of body weight and you know maybe that's not enough or you're not enjoying it. Um, so yeah. And then secondly, I actually built, the, so I got all those weights free. All of those weights I got were free. The 90 kg in the bar, the bar on 25 kg, they were all free. So obviously I'm, I'm borrowing them and they're all free. Like I'm, I'm never, like I never paid a um, penny for them. They're all free, I borrowed it. But this squat rack here, which you saw me use today, the big wooden squat rack, I actually built for 60 pound. So how I did that is I went on to B&Q Click and Collect. There's many other places like Wix, B&Q, Homebase. There's a bunch of places that are doing click and collect and not delivery. And you can click and collect. I ordered some wood and a bunch of um, screws, brackets, bolts, things like that. And, but there's many other designs out there that you can choose from online. So there's many other designs that you can choose from out there online. Obviously, I designed this one, but it cost me £60. This is huge, it's solid. Personally, I believe it will hold up to like 160 kg. I wouldn't want to put anything else on there, um, but I reckon 160 kg is super sturdy. It doesn't even move when I put the bar on it, however hard I hit it. Like, it, this thing is not moving, it's staying still, it's staying exactly where it is. So, yeah, that's how I managed to build my full home gym for only 60 pound. But the main thing is, is put your ego to the side and go and ask people, because people are gonna have. People are gonna want to give. So if you ask 100 people and one person says yes, then at the end of the day, you still have the barbell, you still have the equipment that they give you. And actually, again, I just wanted to touch on is, especially during times like this where it's, things are tough for everyone. Everyone is going through some sort of um, tough time. You have to keep that ingrained work ethic in your head. I haven't, I haven't took a day off so far of working out. You, you keep that work ethic going through the tough times so that when you get to the good times, you can be the successful person that you want to be. More now than ever before, you should be doubling down on working out, putting the work in so you can see those results. Because if you decide that you're not gonna work out during this time, all those gains that you had, you're gonna lose. When you, if you don't work out for these three months that we're in quarantine, it's, it's wraps, all your, all your gains are gone. Like you're gonna come back and if you bench 80 kg, you're gonna be able to bench 50 kg. That's just how it works. More now than ever before, that, that hard work and work ethic that you put into the gym before the quarantine, keep it up now with the body weight exercises, the resistance bands, whatever you're using, just keep it up now because you do not want to lose the gains that you've worked so hard for. Keep those meals up, make sure you're ca counting your calories, go for the walks, use the hour you, we've been given to be able to go around and, and go for the walk or the run or whatever. Keep the work ethic going now, otherwise you will lose it all and trust me, you will regret it in the future. So if you've made it to the end of the video, I appreciate it, thank you so much. Uh, be sure to leave a comment of what your home gym is looking like. If you have a bench or maybe you're just doing body weight or resistance bands, but I wanna know, um, as well as give me some feedback of how I did in this video and maybe you know I can change something in the future. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.